strap in and get ready for this titanium back workout. It's a full Zercher one, and of course I started off with a goat of all Zercher exercises, the Zercher deadlift. Here I am starting off with 70 kilos for my warm up, just getting some reps in, get some movement going. I just competed at Provs the day before, but I didn't go too hard so I'm not too beat up, and I just wanted to have some fun with this workout and see what I could do with just the Zercher grip. So I worked up to 160 kilos and my goal rep range was three to five at about RP seven or eight. I didn't want to go all out for this and max out again, because I just competed at profs, but I'm also getting ready for the upcoming training week and Zerchers aren't my main focus right now. So I want to save some energy for my regular deadlifts and squats that are coming this week. This set of four went pretty good. I kind of switched up how I was pulling for these. And instead of doing that usual scoop that I do at the halfway point, I just kept ripping it and did it more of a full pull instead of switching to a squat in the top third of the lift. I found that this was way more smooth, way more consistent, and it didn't feel as heavy. So I think I'm going to keep pulling them like this as I go forward and see where it takes me. After that set of four, I did a set of three with 160. I misgrooved a little bit. I was set up to one side more, and that took a lot of energy out of me. I just kind of look at it as I was getting some off-center work and some rotational work with it. So I'm happy with how this set of three moved, but it was just a little bit too much to do a third set with. So I dropped down to 140 and ripped a good set of five here. Uh, kept the RPE pretty low, but got a good pump. I have a lot of Zercher deadlifts coming in this workout, so I'm okay keeping it easy a little bit at the start here, not completely burning out. After I finished the deadlifts, I decided to play around a little bit and try to do some jumps with the Zercher grip. My first set, uh, I was jumping pretty good. I just kind of held the Zercher grip without too much thought in it. And the bar was getting up and away from me and pulling me down. It was a lot of fun, but uh, it was kind of tough. So the second set, I took it and I just squeezed really hard. Like I was pulling my hands into my chest here, trying to flex my biceps and forearms so that the bar would really sit in that nook. I jumped a little less high, but the bar stayed close, so I kind of like this, and I'll see what it feels like with heavier weight, uh, and if the bar doesn't jump off of me as much when I jump. After the jumps, I moved on to Zercher squats. These have never really clicked for me, especially because my normal squat stance is pretty narrow, so taking a wider stance feels kind of weird. These just really turned into rack pulls with 150, so I decided that I didn't really like it, tried to switch some stuff up, lowered the weight threw my shoes on and tried to keep a more upright torso for the coming sets. But it just seems that my proportions don't really work all that well for it and it just didn't feel comfortable. I'm sure if I gave it more time, I could find a way to make it comfortable. But again, I'm not really focusing on them right now, so I don't care that much about it. The main thing that I found is that my elbows were just smashing into my thighs and it was pushing my elbows back and making the bar roll forward. Then I took 70, just felt awful. So I got mad and put the bar down and moved on to the next exercise. So here's lunges. Again, now you can see I'm deadlifting them up every single time I'm going to do this. So that does add in some extra deadlifts, even if they are lighter. I've been slacking on my lunges in general. The heaviest one I've hit with a barbell is 150, but 
then I hurt my right knee misgrooving a 140 lunge and I kind of lost balance and fell back. I haven't touched them as much just because they haven't been the most comfortable, but that's feeling all good now. So I'm going to start pushing these a little bit. I think they're fun. They're really easy because as soon as I'm done something like snatch pulls or deadlifts, I can just rip a couple lunges with the weight because I can just pick it up off the ground and start going. So I find there's a little less setup than lunges, takes a little less mental energy and it's fun. Also, the ground is slightly slanted here. So you'll see when I do my right leg on the lunge, I tend to fall to the left a little bit just because I didn't set up off to the side enough. So when I'm coming up and the weight travels slightly to the left, the slant just kind of takes me. So I had to stumble and catch myself there. But overall, pretty good sets. I'm looking forward to increasing this and seeing what I can get to. Now here's a fun one. I hit a nice feet together Zercher deadlift. This is the only time I've done this. So this is a PR. I wrapped out the lunges here. So I was a little out of breath. So instead of doing one leg and then the other leg back to back, I took a quick minute break, caught my breath, let my legs recover a little bit and then ripped the other side. So you'll see this is my last movement. I decided to do some RDLs with 90. I was pretty fried here and just the bottom half and kind of just pump it out. I went until my hamstrings gave out. All in all, this was a pretty good workout. You know, I had pros the day before and then I have a big training week coming up. I had a lot of fun with only using the Zercher grip and I got pretty good work in. So thank you for watching. Now go out there and make some gains. Oh.